In this video, we're gonna take a look to see how we can actually display certain readings, like how fast my motor is moving on the screen. So to display your motor speed, the first thing we're gonna go is this yellow tab where it shows our sensors. These are all our sensors and they, they can send out whatever information uh, they have. So in this case, we wanna send out the speed. My port's gonna be in B and I'm gonna end up sending that to the display and I want that to show up as text. Uh, and what I do is I change this to wired, which means whatever you're reading on the motor, I want you to feed that into the display and it'll show up here. Right now it's like, well, whatever is wired in, that's what we're gonna show. So we wanna show a measure uh, current power, how much power my motor is gonna be doing. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and just create a little loop of my motor going at, turning on and going at 40% speed. Um, and then put that inside of a loop, infinite loop, and then click right here so both of these are going at the same time. Now, the only problem with this right now is it's only gonna show up as a number. I can bring it down and put it in the middle if I want, uh, move it left or right, but I want it to show up, like you saw in the video where it says speed, and then it shows that number, and then it shows a percentage right there. So the way that I'm going to do that is I'm going to use one of these data operations and I'm going to use text. This text thing right here, I'm going to actually disconnect this for a moment. This text thing make, lets me merge uh, multiple pieces of text. So it's like, well, what part, to part A, part B, and part C into one text thing that I can feed into uh, my, my screen. So the first thing I'm going to write is speed with a colon right there. And then the second thing is I want the actual speed, which should be 40% when it's going, to show up after that. And then after that, I want this to say percent. And then take your equals, basically speed, this number, and percent, and I'm going to feed that into the actual text. And I can adjust this uh, if, I, if I run the test and if it's not really centered the way I want it to. But I also need this to be inside of a loop. So I'm gonna move this loop right here because I want this to continually get the speed, not just do it once and then end. Um, you can't really see that, but you can move this up a little bit. This is all you need to do. Feed whatever motor you want to find the speed of into this text merger and then have that show up uh, wired as a text on your display. Have that loop and this is at 40 and that's how we do it. So that is how to get to your motor speed display on your screen.